Central Auditory Processing Disorder, or CAPD for short, is a neurological defect that affects how the brain processes spoken language. This makes it difficult for adult and children to process verbal instructions or even to filter out background noise in the classroom. I'm going to demonstrate how a normal person would hear the example I will show you will be a simple sentence. The fox jumped. Central Auditory Processing Disorder, or also known as Auditory Processing Disorder, or APD, deficits the brain pathways, ascending from the outer, middle, and inner ear. It is a deficit in one or more specific brain pathways involved in processing sound. APD is a complex problem wherein individuals can't process the information they hear in the same way as others. The ear and the brain do not fully coordinate, although hearing is considered normal. With a physician administered hearing exam, something adversely affects the way the brain recognizes and interprets sounds, most notably the sounds composing speech. The primary auditory pathway begins with the auditory receptors in the inner ear, which lead to the cochlear nucleus, then the superior olivary, then the inferior colliculus, then the medial geniculate nucleus, and then finally to the auditory cortex. This is how a normal person hears the sentence, the fox jumped. But with someone with CAPD, we'll hear a wide range of different words, or adds in extra letters. With a few extra letters and words, it changes the entire meaning and understanding of the word. The ox jumped. The box jumps. The boy is jumping. So when talking to someone with CAPD, make sure you are clear and concise. And make sure you talk to them face to face. And last but not least, be patient and understand that with CAPD, it takes many times for a student to understand what you want them to do as well as it will take longer time for the student to complete projects and assignments.